What's up, YouTube? It's me, Kiki Show, and I'm back for another album review. My phone, <laughs> my phone is like that because um, I'm charging it right now, so I had to put it this way, you know, because I don't give a fuck. But today we gotta do none other than um, Prains, Prains, Pur Purple Rain. Because this is this is this is Prince this is Prince's biggest album, right? And unlike Michael Jackson, and this Prince is actually pretty good. You know, this got me thinking. When you know, you remember this video where Prince is there and and James Brown and Michael Jackson, and they're all there performing. Why is there particularly only like Prince and Michael Jackson? I'm gonna tell you why. It's because nobody gives a fuck about Michael Jackson. So Michael Jackson, Prince was the one with real talent, and Michael Jackson was just the the clown guy. You know, they could, you know, Michael Jackson's more like the hype guy. He just hypes everyone. Nobody cares about he has good vocals and good dance movies. He was just a guy who did stuff and everyone was laughing. You know, why you guys think everyone cares about Michael Jackson and nobody barely even knows Prince? But yeah, that don't matter. We're gonna do um, um a Prince. Album review right here, ho! And yeah, guys, um, Prince, Prince. For I have a few questions, Prince. For I know he's there, right? Apparently, allegedly he's there. Prince, first of all, why do you make? Why do you have to release forty studio albums? Do you want to make it hard for us, album reviewers, to review your album? If you make forty albums, we have to listen to all of it, guys. I listened to thirty-three albums of uh, Prince. I still have seven albums to listen, but I'm like, fuck you, man. Why do you make so many albums? Hey, if you make so many albums, your songs, they better be good. Okay, Prince overall is a good artist, but there are so many songs I can stick with it. But I think Prince is the kind of artist, he doesn't want to make music for men or boys. Could this be? Could this be that Prince just want to make music for the ladies? But like only for the ladies. And he's like, you know, I just want ladies to listen to my music. That's why he sounds like, that's why he sings like this. So the ladies like listen to his music and I don't know they get horny. I, I think I think uh, I think ladies get horny when they listen to Prince music. That's what I think. So for the Purple Rain, I can tell you a lot. All I can go say first track. I know this track, but I'm like just like this. If I listen to Prince first track, I'm like this. Okay, then uh, okay. The only song I st I like bump my head to is when doves cry. When Dove's Cry is good. When Dove's Cry is good, it's a good song. But I think, Prince, I think this is your only good song. At least for Purple Rain. This is your only good song. The other songs have been not that good. You had like a bonus version where you have Velvet Kitty Cat. I get it. But nonetheless, none of these songs make me really like a, a hardcore fan. I don't know if it's just me. You know, and... You know, I've been listening to Michael Jackson, but the the the, the thing is, uh, Prince has forty albums. Don't compare. You guys need to stop comparing Michael Jackson to Prince. And be like, oh, why Michael Jack? Why Prince never made a feature with Michael Jackson? Why is that? Guys, stop! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! I'll be even here to tell you that Prince was way better. Then Michael J Prince was way better than Michael Jackson. Okay. And I don't want to hear nothing. Don't come with, oh, but Michael Jackson made Man in the Mirror. Okay. Michael Jackson made Man in the Mirror. What else did he make? I'm going to ask you. What else did Michael Jackson make besides Man in the Mirror? We Are the World? There's a reason why Prince is not on We Are the World. There's a reason why Prince Dawson has a feature with Michael Jackson. It's because Prince at least is the better artist. Okay, and I say this, and, and it was a pain. It was a pain to listen to all your, your songs, Prince, man. What the fuck? What the fuck is this? It doesn't matter. Yeah, man, Prince, what the fuck? Why did you have to release four, 40, 40 uh, studio albums, man? It's a pain to listen to all of it, but yeah. My favorite track from Purple Rain is going to be When Doves Cry. And I know somebody's going to be like, Oh, you like the songs where video clips? I don't give a fuck. This is the only song I can listen Still listen to this day. The other ones I can't. I'm not even gonna get into it. But apparently, apparently this is a ten out of ten album. What do you guys think? Should I give it a ten out of ten? I think I'm gonna give it a ten out of ten because it's Prince. 
And I already give Michael Jackson Thriller album 10 out of 10. So we have to get Purple Rain a 10 out of 10 too. Because it would not be fair. And yeah. But but that's also it. It's going to be very short because... Ah, oh, man, Prince. You got to be all fucked up. You know, but at least Prince... Like, at least there's... You know, I, I'm not a huge fan. But I can see when he's a good... Uh, I can see when an artist is good. So I'm not going to be here and pretend and be like, oh, Prince suck. No, it's like a Prince, you're doing way too much. You're just doing way too much, Prince, man. I don't care. I listen to almost all of your stuff and then I was like, I'm, I'm, I'm good. You know, there's something worse with his eyes, you know. And it's important. It's important to put things in the song to think about. And this is what Prince does. Even if he doesn't do it every time or every, every, every now and then, Prince... Brings out message, you know. This this is what I found out. That's why this this purple rain is a ten out of ten. Even though I'm not a huge fan, I cannot get into it. I can I can get into new artists in general, and Prince shows like oh I, I even tried Prince. So if Prince doesn't get me back into listening to artists, then none of y'all will. None of y'all will. And it's just to make clear to show y'all that Prince was the better artist. Nothing against Michael Jackson. But Prince is definitely better, you know. Prince songs, Prince Prince's songs gonna be talked about years later, and Michael Jackson's songs is gonna be forgotten. I don't care, but the whole other few songs are gonna be like, <laughs> I don't give a fuck. Like this is fucking garbage. If compared, compared, Michael Jackson is a great artist, but yeah, it's not on Prince level though. Even though they make ten out of ten albums, but Prince made forty albums. Okay, Prince made 40 albums. How come Michael Jackson didn't make as, as, as near, nearly as much Prince made? Makes no sense. So yeah, that's why they never made a feature. Prince was probably like, you know, Michael Jackson's trash. I don't want to make an, uh, a feature with him. And everyone would want to make a feature with Prince because he, he's good at making songs. If you have 40 albums, you're certified as a musician. If you guys suck as a musician, make 40 albums. Nobody's going to doubt you ever. But yeah, I think that's it for, for Prince. You know, that's it. It's probably going to be my, my only album review of Prince. But you never know. You never know. I might make more. But I had to make this one first because this is the most iconic one. And I get it with the cover and everything. It 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 is it was it was made to to succeed. It was made to put Prince there, so y'all you guys can see. But yeah, like, as I said, I me personally, I don't really listen to artists no more like that. I don't. And if if I do, it's just like one couple of songs, like getting like albums. And I want to make more album reviews. But then when I go listen to an album, I'm like, I don't want to listen to the trash. And most of the time, guys, albums suck. Okay, most of the times albums suck. And yeah, shots thrown at other album reviewers like the needle drop, you know, I have to say it. I don't know why he why he reviews all these albums because uh, you know, I'm like over 50% is trash. Why would you do a review? Maybe it has nothing to do, you know. Maybe, yeah, but I'll still even if I would be bored, I would never review all these albums because they're really not good. And yeah, these the songs are there to brainwash you. And the more you give them your time and listen, the more garbage. Sometimes I'm shocked. You know, I had a playlist for music. I had a, over 1,000 songs. And when I went back, because I didn't I didn't care about it. It was just there. And then I was looking at it. Let's see what's inside there. And I'm like, many of the songs are not good. There was one song called Carnage. And it's so fucking disgusting. And y'all listen to this nowadays. All these new rappers. Julio, fool you. And stuff like that. Or... Or mad garbage. They are mad garbage. I'm gonna tell you now. All these rappers are shit. Who I smoke. And and you wanna tell me you listen to this bullshit? You guys are fucked. I'm telling you, everyone who listens to music like that and all this kind of stuff and doesn't do no research and doesn't, you know. That's why. That's why I stopped I stopped listening to artists, guys. I, I tried. I wanted to come with a Jimi Hendrix album review. But, hey, guys, you're never going to see no Jimi Hendrix review. Because I listened to his album. He maybe had one good song. And that's it. And I'm like, why are you guys so fucking hyped about all these artists making one good song? It's not even like Nirvana anymore. Or any RD. Or other artists. Linkin Park. Where at least every, every song is good. Right? 
And Prince, the Prince, I don't know if it's just me, but it's you're making it very you're a very hard artist to listen to. And I don't mean it in a good way. I give this one a 10 out of 10, but it was hard to listen to. Yeah, but it was hard. Me personally, I don't fucks with it. I don't fucks with it. Uh, like I said, I like when there's cry. I like the instrumental you used, you know, the, the, the style, the way you you wanted the way you composed everything was good. But you know, at the end the things you said, like it's like a pop rock gospel R and B funk pop album, right? Overall, the things you said I didn't like. Some things you said was right. It was the right thing to say. And that's what matters. Prince, as long as you make one song, if there's one record that's real, that's a true record, it's okay. You can do whatever you want. And it's still going to be 10 out of 10. Prince does it good. And yeah, Prince is one of the only artists, rare artists, who, do, who does music and musician and takes it serious and does it the right way. And every one of y'all who are like, oh, how Michael Jackson is better than Prince. I don't know what to tell you guys. But that's it. That's it for me. That's it for me. Kiko, see you. Uh, how do you find Purple Rain? You like it? You love it? Like I said, it's a 10 out of 10, though. Even if I don't like it. I mean, along the cover, it's very good. So, yeah, guys. If you want another album reviews, comment over. But for me, that's it. Later, then.